So in this training, we're going to talk about confirming meetings, uh, the importance of them, and how to confirm meetings so your prospects show up. Now, a lot of new distributors, they don't confirm the meeting. Confirm the meeting could be uh, whether a prospect shows up for a Zoom or for show up for a face-to-face -face meeting, a one-on-one, -on -one, uh, whether it's Skype, Zoom, or actually a meeting at a coffee shop, right? How many of you had, I always ask this question, how many of you had a prospect that never showed up? All right, if you never had a prospect that never showed up, hey, you know, you have not prospected enough because sooner or later you will have someone that didn't show up. But you can decrease that by confirming the meeting. And I learned this the hard way. One time I, you know, I was in LA. I drove an hour from uh, Santa Monica, where I live, to Lakewood in uh, Lake Forest in Orange County, an hour. And the, I was a hot, hot prospect, great prospect. I was excited and I didn't confirm and the prospect didn't show up. And I was so, so angry at that time. Uh, at that time, I, my motion EQ wasn't as good. I was just like, I wasted an hour of my time, not to mention gas and all that, to go down there. So the, well, I'm going to share with you a couple of things. Number one, you have to confirm the meeting. And the number one reason why you're not confirming the meeting, uh, calling a prospect, making it show up, is the fear of rejection, right? If you, uh, why do you don't re call someone to make you sure they show up? It's because you are afraid, get okay, this mindset, you're afraid they're going to say, oh, I'm not interested. Or maybe you're afraid they're going to cancel on you. That's why you don't show up. That's why you don't confirm, right? The root of why not confirming, it could be a text message or phone call, is because you fear rejection. And once you know that, uh, think about this. If they're going to cancel on you, it's better for them to cancel, better for them to cancel on the phone with you than not to show up. I mean, I wish by looking back, thinking logically, uh, I wish I had called that prospect instead of driving. I wish he canceled on me on the phone instead of me driving an hour there and then finding the, the hard way that he just didn't show up, he canceled that way, right? So, so it's a mindset. You have to get over, overcome that fear of rejection. Now, how do you cancel? Um, how do you uh, confirm a meeting? And it goes back to mindset, right? I always talk about the first thing you do is mindset. It's psychology. It's posture. Having posture, knowing that the more you want them, the more they, they don't want. The more you want them, the more they don't want you. The more you want them to join, the more they don't want to join you. The more it's e the easier it is for them to join you, the less they want to join. There's a great saying from Groucho Marx. I want to repeat this. It's about posture. He says, I don't want to become a member of any club that accepts me. Let's think about that. I don't want to become any club that accepts me. Every one of you here, there's probably some type of club you'd like to be part of. Maybe you can't get in there because you, it's not accepting you because you don't have the money for it. Or maybe you're not at the elite's a certain status. Right? So if it's easy... They don't, people don't want it. Know that. That's psychology, right? So here's something that help you with the meetings, especially helping your prospecting, is the more you reject them, the, right, the more they become interested. So I had a, my uh, mantra was reject them before they reject me. The more I will reject them before they reject me. Every time I'm prospect, I'm sorting. So I want to see, I want to find out a way for, to reject them before they reject me. I don't want them to tell me no. I want to tell no to them. And actually, better way, it made it so much more fun. I was like, hey, you know what? I'm sorry. This business is not for you. Hopefully, you don't get offended or angry. Uh, but you're not the person we're looking for. Bam! Like that. I would just reject people. Most people, I'm like, you know, a lot of distributors are begging, waiting for the person to join. I reject them. I actually don't want them. And the more I push people away, the more they will become interested. So, how do you confirm with a prospect to make them show up? Number one. Contact them the night before. Okay? The latest, the morning before. Contact them the night before. And what I'll do is, for example, I'll call them, call and leave a text message. So someone that is like, um, if it was John, right? I'll say, hey, John, this is Simon Chan. Hey, we have a meeting tomorrow at 1 p.m. Just want to confirm that you're going to show up. And by the way, I know you're busy, but if I don't hear back from you by 9 a.m. tomorrow morning, uh, the meeting is canceled. Okay, you can reply back to me, text, or call me back. But if I don't hear back from you at 9 a.m., the meeting is canceled. See, okay, I tell you, that works wonders. 
Okay, you want to make it noon or 1 p.m., but you, if you don't hear back from you are going to cancel on them instead of you. See, most people, if they're approached by the, uh, people who are selling or people who are uh, in network marketing, that person doesn't cancel. Cause, and then they know, like, well, they want me. The more they want you, right, the more you don't want them. I cancel them. So they'll be like, wow, I got to actually make sure I confirm. And maybe, even if they thought about canceling, they think twice now. Because I'm actually going to cancel on them before they have a chance to cancel on me. Right? Works really, really wonders. And by the way, if they do cancel, great. It's, yeah, you reject you rejected them before they rejected you. You cancel, that's great because, by the way, they were not going to show up anyway. Saves you the time of going there and the frustration. Right? This is a sorting business. You want to get the no as quickly as possible. So, again, call them the night before. Text them. You can text them. Call them. Leave a voicemail. And say, hey, just confirming our meeting tomorrow. If I don't hear back from you. By, and I normally give like a couple of hours. Right? If I don't hear four or five hours uh, before that meeting. And that's important. So I can plan my day. You know, if the person's bad, I want to work on my DMO. I'm not going to go out there and waste my time to travel or even mentally. Mental waste of time. Oh, I got a prospect meeting. How many of you actually have this where you're excited to prospect to a meeting, prospect, and then you change your, your day schedule and maybe you're not even focused on your DMO because you're looking to meet this prospect and then prospect doesn't show up. So you wasted your entire day. Yeah, that happened to me. Okay, when I drove an hour, that mentally wasted my entire day for that. So I wanted to get that no. If they're not going to, if they're going to cancel, great, they're not going to show up. At least, number one, I rejected them before they rejected me. Number two, I cleared up my schedule. I want to know. So I normally I call them the night before. I tell them, hey, let me know by 9 a.m. I would say noon the latest. Okay? If, you're, if you can't make it, let me know. If I don't hear back from you, by noon, the meeting's automatically canceled. Right? The more you take it away from them, the more they want it. All right. So helpful? Okay? Helpful. And this is about sprinting. Um, network marketing is about sprinting, going sprints. You get a lot, lot more done. Reject the prospects. Okay? Okay? Um, People get sick a couple of hours. Yeah, people always tend to get sick. Miraculously get sick a couple of hours before the meeting. But see, then they feel like they have power. Ah, I canceled on them. I don't take that nonsense. I'm canceling on you. You don't call me back. I don't. You, you, the whole meeting is canceled. If I don't hear back even from that certain number, by that time, the meeting is canceled. I rejected them. 